<clears throat> what was going through your mind when you got shot? I thought I was dead. Right now, we are hearing from a brave little boy about the day he got caught in the crossfire while playing at a park. The boy is still recovering after being shot and says he's happy to be alive. Local 10's Alex Finney is live in Pompano Beach with his story and the video police want you to see. Alex. Nicole, it really is remarkable when you see little Noah West's strength. As a result of all of this, we know that he is still recovering all of this happening off of Northwest 18th Street. It happened last month. And as you mentioned there, we have detectives that have released this surveillance video in hopes of finding the person who did this. How are you feeling, Noah? I'm, I'm OK. I'm good for right now. 10 year old Noah West showing immense strength just weeks after getting shot. Do you remember <clears throat> what was going through your mind when you got shot? I thought I was dead, but I looked at myself and I'm like, I'm still alive. New surveillance video giving us a look at the moments before, during and after a drive by shooting in Pompano Beach. Take a look. You see 10 year old Noah West walking across the street. In the next clip, a silver sedan speeds around the corner and police say that's when a person in that car opens fire. You see a man dip down behind a car and Noah sadly getting caught in the crossfire. He was shot multiple times. I got shot right here. I got shot right here. I got grazed right here. I got shot right here. I got shot right there. The person who shot me, he was friends with my brother. Noah says he knows who shot him. The Broward Sheriff's Office is still looking for the shooter. This all happened back on March 22nd around 6.30 p.m. After getting shot, you see Noah running through Hunter Manor's park. I ran to somebody's house and I told him to call the police. I was at a house for like seven minutes. And then they loaded you into an ambulance? Mm -hmm. Noah was in the hospital for over two weeks. He says this park is where he likes to spend time with his friends. But this shooting changed all of that. If I never got shot, I'll probably be at this park right now. But I can't be over. I, I don't want to be over here because it's like it's too much stuff going on. Yeah, it's just so incredibly sad, but a little bit of glimmer of light here. Just so happy to see that little Noah is doing OK. He was with his mother today for that interview. And of course, she, as we've seen in previous interviews, has just been so overcome with emotion. So, of course, this is a happy moment for them. But nonetheless, we know that uh, Broward Sheriff's Office, they are looking for the person who opened fire. If you have any information whatsoever, you are urged to contact Broward Crime Stoppers, that number 954-493-TIPS. We're live in Pompano Beach tonight. Alex Finney, Local 10 News. And that certainly puts a face on just how pervasive this gun violence epidemic that we're all suffering mm -hmm. from is having on us. All right, thank you, Alex, for that.